Hello everyone, my name is Kelvin Osai, um, popularly known as the male nurse on Twitter. I'm a registered nurse, I'm a graduate of the University of Port Harcourt, Nigeria, um, midwife, public health nurse. I am from Anambra State, Nigeria. Yeah. Well, I have cared for and I'm still caring for COVID-19 patients because I work in the emergency department. This is a pandemic uh, situation globally and um, caring for, being in the front line and caring for um, persons who have this is really um, something that I think is an experience that I will never forget. This is what nurses are doing, this is what doctors are doing while they uh, were caring for these persons, were caring for um, COVID-19 patients, suspected cases and every other person. Well, in the midst of the global shortage of PPEs, where I work, uh, we have been supplied with adequate and proper PPE, ranging from face shield, face mask, goggles, gloves, disposable apron, different apron, even disposable scrubs, um, shoe covers and everything. So, um, before you go into the patient's cubicle, you have to fully gown up. Uh, if you're working in the zone, the confirmed cases, you have to always be gowned on and scrub. You can see I'm fully gowned up, everything from head to toe. The safety of nurses in Nigeria is really not guaranteed. Nurses in Nigeria are not being provided with adequate PPEs, um, no uh, life insurance, no hazard allowance. As a nurse, I'm engaging in social media um, because I know a lot of persons will be on social media this period. So it is a very good timing to give out healthy tweets, healthy information and uh, as much as possible engage organizations. For example, uh, one of my videos have been featured by UNICEF Nigeria recently. Um, you can look that up on their Twitter page, yeah, UNICEF underscore Nigeria. Uh, and I'm also encouraging people to practice preventive measures such as social distancing, um, self-isolation, hand hygiene and other measures to reduce it. Me and a couple of others who've been able to engage Twitter, make our presence known, make our plights known, also inform every other person out there that there is need to protect the front line. So um, generally my personal experience with the COVID-19 is really amazing. I've been able to see that every life is important. I've also experienced what we call love. Everyone is showing love to nurses, doctors and all the frontline healthcare workers. So this is one thing that I hold so much, I hold so dearly to my heart. And I pray that everyone out there will do their part to stop this pandemic and reduce the spread. Thank you. Thanks for watching. <laughs>